Thanks, Hendo. The 1939 baseball team is inducted this evening into the Hall of Fame, and the 1939 baseball team is a team of superb players. Five of the members of that team were members, are members of the Watertown High School Hall of Fame, led by Oscar Ski Kadarian, Bill Kearns, Mike Calden, George Jankowski, Frank Hintarelli, Bill Shannon, Matt Keith, Ernie Menino, and Larry Jenkins. They, added a they had a 20-4 and four record and that earned the berth in the state finals at Fenway Park. They were led by three-time All-Scholastic Oscar Kadarian, who was called by the paper The Boy Wonder. He was the shortstop and the team captain in the spark plug, batting 495, and he leveraged his sim slim frame for power as well as average. Antonarelli was at first base, keep at third. Kearns, the key stoner at second base, one of the finest fielding second basemen in the state. Yankowski was behind the plate displaying the form that would take him to the major leagues with the Philadelphia Athletics and the Chicago White Sox. He hit 508 in 1939. It was a consensus all-scholastic. On the mound were such stars and Hall of Famers, Calden and Shannon, Menino and Jenkins. Calden was the pitching sensation of the year. He wound up with eight wins and a 2.41 earned run average, striking out 90 and allowing just 51 hits in 74 innings. Shannon ran up a 5-1 and one record with an ERA under 2, piling up 50 innings of Sterling baseball himself. Watertown was continuing a great tradition. Baseball was king in Watertown in the 30s and the 40s. This Red Raider team was coming off a decade of championship squads with the likes of Whitey McDermott, the great Bob Daughters, George Sexton, and Lefty Lavracus. Their pitching was inexperienced, but they marshaled it all for a 20-4 season. World War II broke out two years after graduation, and that 1939 team joined up with regularity. Shannon, perhaps most notably, won the Navy Cross for extraordinary heroism at Iwo Jima. The 39 baseball team is likely without peer in Watertown's rich history on the diamond. It was an example for all that were to follow. And we would ask two of the members of that team, Hall of Famers and my coach, George Jankowski and Bill Kearns, to receive the plaque in memory and th uh, in memorializing the 1939 baseball team. Coach?
I've seen a lot of ball players. Oscar Kadarian could do everything. He was a marvelous player. And I played with him at the Hosmer School. I went home to West Watertown, where I became acquainted with George. Not a bad acquaintance. You know, I don't, I don't know what I'm doing here. Uh, you can tell this is a disjointed talk. He told me to come up. And I always do what George tells me to do. Always have. The rest of this talk is going to be left to him, and I thank him for the song. I think Bill has said it all. Uh, we had a great bunch of boys. We enjoyed playing. Uh, I've also enjoyed coaching at, at, at Watertown High School for a lot of years. And coaching is fun. It, it, anybody who's here that has coached knows that. And I had fun for all those years. But uh, something, something was said at my table. I'm fortunate enough to be sitting with the superintendent of the school, Sally Diaz, and my wife, who's a school teacher. You know, what we should have is a school teacher's hall of fame. And then, you know, I thought the sixth grade teacher I had, this is uh, really the truth, and I thought of that lady, her name was Alice Sellian, and the shivers went down my spine when I thought what a wonderful person she was. And if you ask me of all the experiences I had in my high school career, or, or school career, not my high school, the whole, whole career, I, I think of my sixth grade teacher. 